Today is February 11th and this is a germination update. Here are the green onions. These longer, two longer tufts are from, excuse me Alistair, please be quiet. They're from November 21st, 2021 and they're this tall and that thick. And then these germinated the last two days. They are from February 1st, 2021. Here's a ground cherry. Over the last few days, it, it grew this, this, this many. <laughs> and then here is the purple basil from the Arrow Garden. And looks like some other basils germinated. There's one there, one there. I think I saw another one on the other side. Oh, here's some purple right here. You can barely see beneath that rock. Here is my kale that I put a lot of in. It's pretty leggy. I might bring it upstairs to the grow light. Um, there's kale right here, and there's red mustard, and there's the blue curd kale. Looks like no, none of the purple kale has germinated. Um, I don't know if there's any in the ones that I dropped in, but I did put in a lot. Here is the uh, flower bucket. This this is the fastest growing thing I've ever seen. When I when I went out. Two days ago there was n like these two in the spot and then when i came back this is that height it obviously is very leggy um because the window and the sun is up there and so there's one two three four five there's a baby one right there six this is my dying soybean it's like crispy like literally just crisp and chart is recovering Here's two different bok choys. None of them are purple. I did put two purple and two green ones, so we'll see how the purple one does. And then here's my Thai basil from the Arrow Garden that is dying, but we shall see if it decides to perk up. I think I overwatered it, so it drowned. Um, so I stopped watering it, but now I think I should water it again because uh, there's some crispy leaves in here. Continuing on, this is the flower tray. Here are two types of zinnias. They're starting their first new leaves. Um, I mean, true leaves. And their their starter leaves are just so cute, adorable, and they're like round. Um, let's see, this these are snapdragons. They are tiny and adorable. Nothing's coming out of this, which is, uh, oh, here's some coxcomb. That's interesting. It's like red underneath. There you go. Be free. This is the first thing that showed up, which is Cosmos. And they're starting to grow true leaves and they look like weeds to me. Like plants that fly in from everywhere. And then here's Bachelor Buttons. They're also getting their first true leaves. Um, I don't know why this one's here on the side. I must have like accidentally dropped the seed over there because I would never have planted it over there. How long does your buttons grow like a whole bunch? Oh, here's one petunia. There's a lot of little, little yarrows. They're so cute. And here is ground cherry. Oh, yes. First one, ground cherry. It won't focus. I'm sorry. Oh, because I don't have a macro lens. Here is the two charred yellow and red. What else is in this pot? That's it. Oh, bok choy. Bok choy has... Not seeing this one yet. I might move that downstairs. Or no, this one. This one is coleus. There's four seeds in here and nothing has happened. And this is three types of peppers or tomato and pepper. Nothing has happened. This is the carrots. So I'm gonna take the two non-germination ones downstairs to see if they'll like the heat or not. Here are the peas. Um, Which one is this? This is the sugar snap and it grew up the fastest and I had it this way so it was growing towards the light so I'm turning it around. And this is uh, soybeans. And then Tom Thumb has not germinated yet. I was trying to like dig it out so there's like a divot right here. And then yeah, the carrots are the most interesting. They're kind of leggy looking but the light is up to right here so I don't see why it would be leggy. Um. Yep, that's my update. Thanks for watching. Bye!